just uh, a general statement for the uh, for the general uh, attendees that if you have any questions please as we go through these uh, uh, discussions please you know present your questions uh, and uh, what i will do is i'll address some of those questions to the panelists um okay now going going back to the same sort of uh, point that was uh, we initiated this whole scenario with and that is about this individual who's gone to this masjid and here he's seen one particular timetable and his father follows another timetable what kind of advice would you give somebody like this who's quite confused about prayer times um, especially in the month of ramadan which is quite an important month ensuring that you're reading at the right time and so forth um mufti amjad could you elaborate on what kind of advice you would give somebody like this? Uh, this is more of a usuli question, and the usuli question that we have is that we have hand in hand, uh, ijtihad or tahkik, and also taklid. Taklid meaning that we just blindly follow a position without necessarily knowing how that position was reached. So each individual it would depend on that person. Now, if that person is a relatively uh, a, a relatively intelligent person, is keen to know how the timetables have been reached to, then that person can quite easily go speak to the Imam Sahib and say, Imam Sahib, you know, I've noticed that so-and-so down the road is praying at X time, you're praying at Y time, why is that? And ask the question and actually ascertain what the reason is and then make that decision themselves. And obviously that depends on the level of the individual. It could be the individual doesn't, to be honest, care, has a very carefree attitude or lacks that capability or ability to be able to discern the difference between two positions. And in that case, I guess he would do taklid at the most basic level. So really, it would depend on the uh, the individual and what that individual wants to seek. You know, if there are many people who are very concerned, I, I, I sort of over the last month especially, that have been in touch with me, very concerned about prayer times and, 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 and eating when they think they should be fasting. But then the, the question which comes up is, what well, our masjid is doing at X time, what should I do? So I give the same answer that I just, I just uh, uh, explained here, is that if you want to know the reason, ask, and they will demonstrate the reason to you. If someone cannot demonstrate the reason to you why they tell you to continue to eat at three o'clock or four o'clock, then that clearly sends alarm bells uh, to you that hold on, why am I doing something in which there's no, there's no clarity? Okay, Jazakallah.